Bosan. Check it out. I fell in love with Kate Bush when I was in middle school. My uncle Russell, my favorite uncle, turned me on to her, and I listened to Running Up the Hill every morning as I rode to school on my bike. I was that kid from Stranger Things. I'm talking about, like, I think they really took my interview and put it in Stranger Things. So since then, I've been obsessed with her music, and I've remained her biggest fan. I know that some of you are thinking, what does Kate Bush have to do with hip hop? <laughs> she is such a unique artist. You might as well also ask, what does Kate Bush have to do with rock and roll? On the surface, our music is obviously very different, but in important ways, it's exactly the same. What I love about Kate's music is that I never know what sound I'm going to hear next. She ignores anything that seems like a formula and instead just does whatever she wants to do, like me. She challenges me as a listener and expands my ears and my mind. No matter how many times I listen to albums like The Dreaming or 50 Words for Snow, yeah, yeah, they sound fresh and surprising every time. They fill my head with ideas and expand my ambitions for what music can achieve. As a singer, Kate's voice is incredibly, incredibly inventive. Who sound like Kate Bush? Nobody like Kate Bush. <laughs> on stage, she's a miracle. Her songs sound theatrical when you just hear them on their own, and in performance, they actually become theater. Kate is a songwriter, producer, and performer without equal. If that's not hip hop, I don't know what it is. When I did know Kate, I imagined that she lived in a castle in London, like high on the top of the mountain, right there, tails, and playing a big ass piano that, you know, super big, like Buzz Bunny Bee. <laughs> the truth is, a little bit different from that. I met Kate, we had long conversations. I introduced my family to her, and I met her son, like, um, I did her shows in London. It was, it was cool. It's just two hearts, baby. Let's go! Yeah. It does not surprise me at all that Kate has enjoyed a huge surge of popularity decades after she emerged on the scene. After all, if you were hearing Kate's music for the first time, why wouldn't you believe that she was a current artist? The only mistake that you might make is thinking that all the artists she influenced had influenced her. But it's every much but it's every much the other way around. Who the fuck? Okay. <laughs> even the musical artists who have never heard of her, or even heard of her. Did you go to class? <laughs> she is a true artist, a true visionary, and that's why Kate Bush belongs in the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame. <laughs> <laughs> 